The number one subject I need to cover is population reduction. The UN has been caught over and over again worldwide adding sterilants to vaccines in Latin America, in Africa, uh, in Asia, in the Middle East. You can just pull it up. It's mainline stuff in the mid-1990s when the first time they got caught sterilizing people. Every year, for decades, there are news articles where they report, hey, the United Nations was giving people live polio shots or um, oral. Or, oh, uh, the, the U.S. or the U.N. was caught injecting kids with syphilis. Yeah, it wasn't just black folks here until the 1970s. Uh, oh, U.S. troops were experimented on until they died. Oh, the Pentagon says DU is safe for troops to use now. Oh, EPA rules uh, that uh, you can get 100,000 times of you know, this isotope or that isotope now of radiation from Fukushima. I know it's hard to believe, but they don't want us. They see it as they own the planet now. They've got advanced technologies at least 30 years into the future. That's admitted, and they have got cures for what they're going to release. Everything else, HIV, Pentagon program, uh, we've got the government funding for that program. They didn't call it HIV. It was a Navy-engineered um, cancer virus to cause autoimmune disorders. Uh, it's also race-specific. It's very hard for Northern Europeans to get it. That's in the mainline studies. And they've got all these movies and all this culture about when the big plague comes, what's going to happen. And it's even been in the mainstream news. You can pull it up. Rich buying bunkers in Russia, in the U.S. I've talked to a lot of contractors, uh, places like Colorado Springs and places where the real government's based. Uh, even mid-level people are spending every dime they've got uh, for these shelters that have the rebreathers and things on them because they're not worried about airborne flu. They're worried about jet spraying it, folks. When they, If they decide to pull the trigger on this, it's going to be helicopters. Sunshine Project um, and the Marine Corps asked that be reclassified, picked up some classified documents that, that were declassified 11 years ago out of Austin. And the, the Marine Corps flipped out and said reclassify that and threatened them, but it's still on the Google archive. I guess they threatened Google and they didn't care. And it talks about helicopter bases, mothballed, you know, waiting with the different gases, knockout gases, opiates, but also other little goodies. And now, soon they're not going to need humans. They've already got drone helicopters they were using against Gaddafi, drone jets, and that's why the, the system wants that. That's why they have the regular pilots do so many drills with, quote, spraying simulants on cities. They call live bacteria like Subtilis globigii. They've sprayed on most cities, quote, a simulant of how a bio attack would take place. The point is the people that are telling you they're protecting you from terrorism, from all the open source research, are the terrorists. And they write public policy books about how much they want to kill 80 to 90 percent of the population. And they have all these movies coming out conditioning you to be so scared of the flu. So when there's a normal flu, you get totally scared and run out and get a shot. But you're not 